Hey, it's Allison from Computers.Mom. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take an Excel spreadsheet and turn it into a Google Sheet quickly and easily. I'll show you how to avoid one of the common mistakes people make and also how to share the Google Sheet when you're done uploading. So let's get started. Start in your favorite web browser. You can be on the Google main page like this or looking at your Gmail inbox. Just make sure you're signed into your Gmail account. Click the little grid of squares in the upper right hand corner of the page and select Drive. Now you're looking at the main Drive window with any documents you might have saved in there intentionally or otherwise. It's very easy to upload our sample spreadsheet. Click New, then File Upload. Then navigate to the spreadsheet you want to add. This one, as you can see, is on the desktop of my Mac. And then click the button marked Open. That was easy, but there's a small problem. This spreadsheet is still in Excel format, as you can see from the green X icon. So even though it's in my drive, it won't have all the useful features of a Google Sheet. This is a common mistake, but really easy to fix. To do this properly, we have to change a setting first. Click the little gear up here, then click Settings, and check the box to automatically convert uploaded files to Google's own formats. That applies to spreadsheets and also to word processing documents and so forth. Now we repeat the process. Click New, File Upload, choose our file, click Open. But this time, the file is automatically converted to Google Sheets format, which means we can share it for editing or viewing purposes. Before I share this file, I'm going to give it a more useful name by typing over the generic name at the top of the sheet. Let's also dismiss this new feature alert from Google, which is kind of blocking our view. Now that the spreadsheet is in Google Sheets format, we can share it easily by clicking the blue Share button. Just type in the email address of the person you want to share with, or more than one if you like, just as if you were writing an email. And if the person's in your Google Contacts already, you can add them by name. Then add a little note down here to personalize the share message. That's not required, but it's a good idea so the recipient will know it's really from you and not a phishing attack. Optionally, click on the pencil here to choose whether the recipient can edit freely, only comment, or only view the sheet you are sharing. Then click Send, and you're done. Changes are saved automatically, so you can just close the tab for this sheet when you're finished. And when you're ready to find the sheet again, use the quick and easy search box on the main drive page. Notice that both the Google Sheet and the Excel Sheet version show up when I search. Make sure you're opening the right one. So a quick recap. From anywhere in your Gmail account, click the grid and choose Drive. Then click the gear and settings. Make sure the convert option is checked. You only have to do that once. Then for each file, click New, File Upload, choose the file you want, and share away.